I'm Allie Rokas here with this week's Mean Green Minute. Mean Green Tennis finally returns home, softball opens up their season, and track and field shows strong this weekend. But first, Mean Green Basketball loses both their games on the East Coast. Thursday, the Mean Green held Old Dominion to its second lowest halftime score, but the Monarchs answered back holding North Texas to their lowest score of the season. Sophomore Jeremy Combs recorded his eighth double-double in the 67-47 loss. Saturday, the team struggled defensively in Charlotte. Combs finished with 24 points and 9 boards, and point guard Jamichael Reese added 18. But the 49ers went over the century mark for the second straight game, beating North Texas 103-79. They fall to 4-8 in conference play. North Texas heads back home to host both Florida schools starting with FIU Thursday, with tip-off set for 7 p.m. After losing in double digits to Old Dominion on Thursday, women's basketball closed out their two-game homestand with the team's annual pink game against Charlotte on Saturday. It was part of the Play for K initiative to raise awareness in women's cancer research. Both junior Kelsey Kreiner and senior Eshel Tack recorded double-doubles. The Mean Green took the lead for the first time in the fourth quarter with this Tack layup to go 57-56. to but a 16-6 run by the 49ers to end the game handed the Mean Green their fifth straight loss. North Texas falls 82-70. Next up, they hit the road to Florida for the weekend, starting with FIU on Thursday and FAU on Saturday. And softball is officially back, starting their season in the Hillebrand Invitational in Arizona. Day one started against number 13 ranked Arizona. Junior Kelly Schade took the second pitch of the game to left field for the first home run of the season. But they lost to Arizona 9-1. They would split day one by then beating Nebraska Omaha 11-3 in a run roll win. Day two started against UC Santa Barbara and despite an early 2-0 lead, they lost to the Gauchos 6-3. The second game of the Saturday doubleheader, North Texas rallied with five runs in the bottom of the seventh against Southern Utah. They take the walk-off win 6-5. Then on Sunday in their final matchup against Purdue, they needed another rally in the seventh as they were down 6-0. Freshman Harley Perella hit her first career home run to right field, but that's where the scoring would end as they would lose 6-1. They open the season 2-3 and, and head to Waco this weekend for the Getterman Classic. Track and field finished strong with men's taking second and women's taking third in the Herm Wilson Invitational. North Texas finished with eight second place finishes and six titles. Senior Eddie Wilcox took home first place for the second straight meet in the men's high jump, clearing a new personal best of 2.13 meters. Junior Colin Hurd won the men's 200 meter for the second time with a season best time of 21.56. Next up, track and field head to Indiana for the Alex Wilson Invitational in South Bend. And finally, women's tennis returns home, winning both their matches against La Tech and OU. The Mean Green picked up its second win and diminished La Tech's four game winning streak in a four to one victory. The success started early with the dynamic freshman duo of Maria Kononova and Tamuna Kudabidzi winning their doubles match 6-3. In singles, three wins in Captain Agustina Valenzuela, freshman Maria Kononova, senior Camila Galieva, gave the North Texas the victory against the Texters in singles. Next up, tennis heads east to Virginia to take on VCU February 20th. And that's it for this week's Mean Green Minute. Check out MeanGreenSports.com for your update on North Texas athletics.